Hey guys, we are Heart of Austin Home Team, uh, Homes Team. I'm Elise. Plural. <laughs> I'm John. Many homes, one team. Um, and, um, and we have this month's Hot or Not. Um, and this is for November 2018. Obviously, when we talk about November's Hot or Not, it has to talk about October statistics. So, But since this is December, <laughs> we get to talk about November stats. So... Um, we wanted to actually start this off with a little trivia question about Austin. Um, so you can learn something while you watch in addition to cool real estate statistics, which... And not it, it says something likes. about Austin too. This is fun. I know. I think right. it's a really cool fact. So the question is, yeah. who or what was the original UT mascot? Don't Google so, it. Or don't. Google it, but just don't put it in the comments. <laughs> or Google it and put it in the comments, despite us, whatever. Um, okay, awesome. What should we start with, babe? Uh, okay, so we've done a little bit extra work since last time, because we did the whole like month versus year thing. Mm -hmm. So let's start with the year. This is, of course, the Austin column, the South Austin column. I always say when South Austin is South of 71. Yeah, so uh, it's 78744, 78747, 78745, 78749, and 78743. Okay, I'm, I'm bored already. I know. I'm sorry. I just <laughs> wanted to be specific. <laughs> so, so that's what South Austin is, and this is a really interesting comparison. So, um, South Austin um, had 200 homes sold in um, November. In October. No, in November. Oh, because it's December. This is December, Sorry. right? <laughs> Time, it keeps going forward. I have a newborn. Time does not go forward. For yeah, you me. can use that excuse for a while. <laughs> so, anyway, in November, 200 homes sold in South Austin out of seven and 722 sold in all of Austin. Right, so, so it's yeah. a good portion, you know, yeah, a third or fourth. A little over a third. Yeah, yeah. Not two, under third. Two right. sevenths, if you will. Right, two sevenths, <laughs> if you will. You, you never guess we were really good at math right. somewhere back there. Okay, so what was it last year? Last year? It's the same month last da, year. Da, da, da. It went down 13% since last year. So the number of homes sold in all of Austin is down for November 2000. Um, 18 versus New November, November 2017, it went lot. down 13.7. Right, so that's not a seasonal thing. That's like the same month last year yeah. sold 821 homes. Yeah. Right, and so we only sold 722. Yeah. What about South Austin? South Austin. Down, oh. down 6%. Dude, this is just not a good November. No one is, no one's buying homes in, uh, in this November. In November? Last November? Well, you know, but remember last month it was up. That's true. Well, we're not so, done with the numbers, this, so this it gets, is, it gets yeah. weird later on. Yeah, yeah. So last month might have just been a freak positive, and then yeah, this yeah, one's compensating. True. Everyone's making up for it. Um, but look, that this one's only it's only down six percent in South Austin versus Compared down to, fourteen. Yeah. And um, this is really, I think, this is really fascinating. So look at this. Um, in South Austin, almost half the homes that were on the market um, in November sold. sold. Yeah. So they're selling, and I see that every day. Yeah. So and we one see and two. That. So if you're selling your home, you have to be in the top half. Of yeah, homes in exactly. Right. At least in the top best, well priced yep. and best yep. condition, etc. Yep. But look, only about a third um, in all of Austin sold. Yep. Versus last year, whoa, down ten percent. So there are fewer, less to buy too. Which less things to buy. Means which prices going really up. explains why there's yep. less sold. Because yep. I mean, there's less seriously. to buy. Yeah, there's just less inventory. Yep. And then for South Austin, up, it's up six point two. Oh right. my gosh. So there's more listings in South Austin. That's true. Well, this might have something to do with the prices are going up in South Austin too. Because last, last year, um, November 2017, mm -hmm. it looks like nine, or 396 homes um, sold. Yep. So that's awesome. So people are cashing out. Well, and cashing out and also people are, um, South Austin's just becoming cooler. Yeah. It's becoming, it's really hip. It's, again, it's one of the only places where you can still get a reasonably priced house. Yeah. So close to downtown. Okay, what about this? The median price. median price. Again, what is the median? I quiz you on this every time. It is if you lined up all the different house prices at things sold at, it would be the one in the middle. Not the average. Not the average, because that gets skewed by really high price houses. Yep. Like what we just sold. Um, so, <laughs> um, um, the median price um, for all of Austin was $387.75. Yep. Uh, versus South Austin, it's really, it's getting closer. Um, yeah, 335, you're only, what, 50 away? Mm -hmm. Yeah. 52, if you will, um, versus last year. So the prices are still going up. That doesn't, not surprising. Yeah. Less inventory, still po positive still demographic pressure. 
right? So okay. prices are still I'm going sure up. you were really yeah. surprised by that one. So 4.6%. And but then, how much is South Austin at? South Austin year over year of 6.8%. 6. 6. So it's appreciating more quickly. November to November. Yeah. Nice. So if, if you're if you're down here, your price is going up faster. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. True. Okay. And then um, we already looked at the comparison between these. Yes. Yeah, so now I'm looking for a month. Now, so this number is for October. Yeah. Exactly. Not to be confused with September because I'm right, back. Because it's now December. Because I've lost a month. So in, in one month. <laughs> in Austin. What do we got? 21 percent okay so, so this that's, so. there i'm telling you last month was just like a freak month yeah um october was a freak high month and so november is just compensating to come back coming back down yeah. so there are 21 percent less homes that sold in all of austin yeah. in um november versus um october of this year yeah um in all of Austin, it looks like two um sorry well, i'll get the wrong stat for myself yes. um 874 um sold in October. In, in October. Okay, so South Austin. And that's a 13% high jump. So fewer still, but not as much, not as yeah. drastic of a drop. So again, South Austin's a little hotter. Right. Okay, what about active, number of actives? Okay, down 11%. Down 11%, in geez, one month. in one month. Yeah. So an extra 12, almost 12%. And, and some of this is seasonal, yeah. right? Yeah. Like we're heading into the holidays, not as much as selling. Um, there's not as much activity. Not as many people putting them on the market. Yep. But on the other hand, I do believe that um, that, that is disproportionately high. Yep. And then South and that matched. About the same. Perfect. Yeah. Ding, ding. All right. What about the median price versus last month? Just in one month. Same. No change exactly between October and November of this year Selling in all of Austin. Fewer of them, but the prices are moving. What about South Austin, though? Oh, this is the fun one, I think. Can I call you Van O? Sure. <laughs> Because Latin O is masculine. Exactly. Okay. Look at that. Yeah. South Austin's still going up. Six percent. So okay, now get this. This is interesting. Look, last year you had a six point eight percent hike okay. year over year. Yeah. You also had a hike going into the slow season. What this really says is that probably October's low was um yeah. Ian was probably particularly Might low. Might have been a little off. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It's just it two gets, data points, so yeah. it's, it's <laughs> fine. Yeah. Exactly. When you're only talking about two hundred ish homes selling in a month. Like, you know, it can get swayed more easily. But I just think it's interesting that it went up by the same amount that it went up year over year yeah. last year. And so just like something yeah. happened in yeah. October. Yeah. October was special. Yeah. Uh, which is funny because October is usually a crazy, crazy slow month. Okay. Yep. So has anyone figured out what? Or just no, because you've been in Austin for a long time. <laughs> the original mascot of UT was. Well, here's a hint. Go to Austin Pets Alive. What's the most common dog breed down there? And this is kind of funny, right? His name was Pig, the pit bull. Yep. Um, he was named after, you know, originally somebody who was really important at UT. It's We're like not going to dog. Like, yeah. yeah, yeah, exactly. He was the coach's dog. And, um, and so he was hanging out there all the time. But um, my understanding is that pit bulls, as a result, got really, really popular in Austin. So everybody was letting their pit bulls breed and making lots of pit bulls. And then pit bulls went out of vogue um, because they got a bad rap. And... Now, because sometimes they were used for fighting, and yeah, like yeah, and trained for being bad doggies. But it explains why you see all these pit mixes at Austin Pets Alive. Yeah, Austin Pets Alive is just They're full everywhere. of pit bulls. Um, so, yeah, a little bit sad, but also kind of fun. And our doggie is is um, also a pit mix. Is a pit mix, a pit lab mix. Because lab, we live in lab. Austin. Yeah. <laughs> Although Pets, Austin Pets Live did tell us that they thought she was part Boston Terrier. Well, they're in the business of getting rid of dogs. <laughs> They'll good, tell you what you want to hear. Getting rid of finding good homes That's for right. John. The marketing is important. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> they got rid of that dog to a nice home. They did. Ours. We love her. <laughs> she's a great dog. Um, she's literally our office dog she's over there on the mat. Um, anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this. Let us know what you thought was the coolest fact or um, or the stupidest joke, um, one or the other. If you want um, to see any different stats, let us know. Yeah, down we below. love to talk about it. Um, and obviously, if you know anybody who's looking to buy or sell, we would love, love, love to help them. You can move these stats yourself. <laughs> <laughs> so, thank you guys so much. We'll see you next month. Yeah, mwah.